So I have my 14 Pro Max here that I've been using. Let's just bring that alongside it. The iPhone 14 Pro Max on the right here is just the tiniest bit. So I don't think this is actually gonna work. I mean, you have that button there, which in this case is a kill switch, but typically that's you know cut out anyway. So you're not gonna have a button format here, but you will have, um, you know, just you can press the button there, but let's see there. It's a little bit small. Let's take that off. Just a tiny bit loose, little bit loose. You can see it just ever so loose. But I don't have a case with me right now, so I'm actually gonna, you know, not right now, I'm gonna put this on, but I, you know, I can't have an iPhone without a case. I gotta order myself a uh, screen protector. This was an impulse buy, so I have to order myself a screen protector uh, in the next few hours, basically. Um, but for now, I'm actually gonna leave this case on here because it does look like it will work for now. Uh, it is slightly too big because there's a tiny, like half millimeter height difference on the 14 Pro Max versus this here. Next up, we have the lens protector. This is, I think, from JTEC. Yeah, which I find makes pretty good stuff. There's on Amazon. There's absolutely no communication or affiliation with them. I just use them. I have these lens protectors here for the 14 Pro Max. These are a good idea because once you get a scratch on your lens, you're going to be very upset. Oops, it's a little tight. Oh, it was just placed off. That actually worked perfect. So the lens orientation looks to be identical. See that there? Like a glow. So now I have a protector on my lens, uh, a temporary case, right? We can use that. Uh, that's not going to be a permanent fix. It's a little loose, but until mine arrives, it gives me a little bit of confidence to actually use this device because I'll be the type who will you know, have a brand new iPhone and I never drop my phones. And then the day that I get a new one, I'll drop it and break it. Phone. 14 Pro Max screen protector, and this is not going to work, I don't think. Yeah, see, it's a little tiny bit too tall. All right, so if we line that up there, just hold it very tight, perfectly. Just ever so long. But, but I mean, if you have one lying around, it may suffice. Let's see if it fits. I'm going to try to do this, not looking through the camera lens, reaching around. Um, let's see if it works, but let's get it all cleaned up. Probably should have done this before getting gross fingerprints all over it, but why live in the past? In a now this is going to be very snug, so you're going to have to make sure you're right up at the top. Yeah, it's a little bit too big. Just ever so slightly too big. You can see there, it's not connecting, right? So the 14 Pro Max screen protectors are not gonna work, you can see there. Just a tiny bit too big. You can see even on the side there. And I can press it down, you're gonna get a lip. I mean, if you have it lying around, you don't need it, you don't have anyone who needs it, you can put it on here for today type thing, but you know, it doesn't actually work. So it looks like the final verdict is if you have some of these lens protectors, um, they do actually appear to be compatible. It's already all slimy, look at that. Imagine that was my screen. Um, does actually appear to be compatible, like 100% compatible, no issues whatsoever. Uh, the cases are semi-compatible. Um, I mean, all the buttons line up perfectly fine. You have no issues there with the buttons, uh, but there is a slight shortening of the iPhone 15 Pro Max. So it's just, I don't even know, like a half a millimeter. So it's just a tiny little bit too small, but it'll work. I mean, it's not going to fall out, right? So in a pinch, if you have a 14 Pro Max and you're just like, you know, I didn't buy a phone, you know, I didn't buy a case or whatever from Apple. Maybe you did, maybe you didn't. Maybe you're going to wait for some reviews on Amazon. You can do that. That works totally fine. Screen protector, uh, not so much. <laughs> you know, the screen is just a tiny little bit smaller, right? So you just have that lip all the way around that connects and you know, it's so bad down here that I'm actually getting like it's raised up there. You cannot use the iPhone 14 Pro Max screen protectors. I mean, you can put it on for now, but it you know doesn't fit.